welcome to my channel my name is Alasi Ruth and today we are making suya one of the easiest tastiest recipes you need to try it's perfect for a barbecue I have the list of the measurements and the ingredients you need you can get beef or use chicken but make sure it's thinly sliced ah <sighs> I was thirsty people I was really thirsty so I had to go for a quick drink there's no alcohol in it so you could relax <laughs> I have my beef, I have my suya, I have my pepper, my oil, onions, and the sticks. Make sure you soak them in water for at least one to two hours, depending on what time you're going to make them. And I have my Maggie over there and my drink, of course. Yay! Now I'm just grating the onions because I love an onion flavor in whatever I'm eating. And you can skip the stuff you don't love onions like that, but I think you should because suya... It's kind of predominantly onions and lots of spices. So maybe you should start loving onions, just like me. Now I'm just going to add in my Maggie and I'm going to be adding in my oil. And I'm just mixing and mixing. Mix, mix, mix. Mix, mix, mix. Mix. Ooh, and I'm putting that away, of course. You want your area to be clean as much as possible. I started cutting the steak, I would say, and of course the knife. So I just had to get my kitchen scissors. Much easier, honestly. As you can see how thin my beef is and I'm just skewering the beef right now and make sure you're very careful because the stick is very very sharp extremely sharp but thank God I didn't hurt myself praise the Lord so remember the rub we made in the beginning I'm just rubbing it on with a kitchen brush okay it's a kitchen brush by the time you're done making the suya, people will call you to come cater to your wedding. I'm just mixing my pepper and my suya spice together. If you don't want the pepper, of course don't add it if you don't want it to be too spicy. And just rub it and make sure you get every part of the meat. Finally, time to grill it. If you don't have a grill, you can also use your um, oven and just make sure you preheat it while you're preparing to make the suya. Don't be like me. Make sure you put the seal on the grill first before turning it on because it was hot as you can see. And I'm just adding just normal oil just to give it a shine while it's grilling. Doesn't that look delish? I know you want to eat it. Go make your own right now. Also, make sure you get a good cut of meat and make sure it is fresh because you're just going to be eating something from the 99 cent store and it's not going to taste like suya. It's easy to make by the way as you can see. Doesn't that look great? Yes, I know. I already told you. Go and make your own. I cannot share this. Okay, I can only help with the video. Go and make your own. It's delicious. Oh, Mm-hmm. Uh uh, look at that. You want to tell me you don't want to eat that? My friend, go and make your own. I just cut off some onions, as you can see, and I just added a little bit of sea spice on top of it, and it looks amazing. I enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Oh, double.